Devon Camargo, 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 Camargo. Well, it's a Devon camper van. It's a two berth camper van with four belted seats and it's just under five meters long. It's a 2009 camper van with just under 24,000 miles. It's 3,300 kilograms and it's a 2.5 litre diesel. Right, let's have a look at the cab. It's on a Renault Master. Um, it's six speed. We have CD, radio. We also have air conditioning. And then we do have our blown air, hot and cold, um, with the different speeds. Um, what else have we got? I think that's about it. So let's work our way around the van. Um, diesel. And then what we do have is we have our 230 hookup. And then this is our wastewater drain down. And then, ooh, there's our flue for our heating system as well. And there's the flue for our hot water. And then we'll work around. I'll just open up here. And then if you just come around, what we have here, there's our cassette water. Cassette water is our cassette toilet. That's where we can empty the toilet. And then coming around to the side of the van, what we've got, is that's our fresh water filler and that's our fresh water drain off. Oh, hello. So let's have a look at this little Devon camper van. Both seats do swivel round. Um, come inside, let me just show you this area here, the dinette. So what we've got, we've got two seats and both these seats do have seat belts and they can be made into single beds, which I will show you in a moment. What we do also have, we have our table. Got that right first time, didn't I? Um, so we've also then got a nice little dinette area and it's a good size for the camper van as well. And then what I'm gonna do now, get yourself inside and we'll have a look at the back. So let's have a look towards the back of the van. We've got our kitchen area and then we have our cupboards above and another storage area here. And then let me lift you this up. We do have a two burner hob. Thank you, Finn. Which does have a catch up at the back. So we've got the two burner hob and also we do get a grill area as well. So next to our hobs, we do have our sink. So it's a good deep sink there as well, if you just have a quick look. And the good thing as well for the camper van, it does have hot and cold water. And I'll just quickly show you the hot and the cold water. So here's our gas, and then here's our electric. So we do have the option, if we're wild camping, we can use the gas. If we're on a campsite, we can use the electric. So hot and cold water. And then while we're here, we do have a Wabasto heating system. So that's the diesel at work. It powers off the diesel, uses the diesel as the fuel. So we get a blown air system as well to keep us warm. And then above the, the gas hot water and also the Wabasto, we have our control panel. Um, so we've got our unit here. We have a battery select. We have our pump um, and then also we've got our fuses and then we do have our 230 fuses as well. So I'll show you the shower. We do also have a little bit more prep room as well. 
so we've got this tabley thing that comes down where we can do our cooking we've got a good prep area and then we do also have another prep area so there is there is a decent size uh, for such a small camper van um, under five meters where we can actually prep now we'll move into the shower so let's have a look inside the shower now before you do have a look at the shower we do get the door stopping here so also a good area then for just getting ready and then i'll show you inside the shower it, it is a combined shower toilet so we've got the mirror going down and then we have our sink with our hot and cold tap and then we do have our cassette toilet and then what you find here this will come up then to make a shower and then it is quite a good size so i'll just show you inside we do have a well it's not a big size but it's a compact size um, which is ample room really um, for this type of camper for just getting a, a wash and a quick um, splash down really so we'll make our way towards the front what we also have which i did forget is we do have our fridge our little 12 volt compressor fridge again plenty of room little freezer area and then we have our shelves and like a little salad area and then we do have our shelves on the side of the fridge door and if we make our way to the front we do have a big skylight as well just show you that which opens up and then we have our blinds and also fly screen the same again with the side window blinds and fly screen and then the window does open see the click and then we take it all the way up and then that closes it and now what we'll do is i'll show you how to make the beds up well one of them right so the van has two single beds so first thing we'll send the seat around the passenger seat to there and now what we've got to do is bring this part over so i'll take the cushion over I'll take the cushion off there and then what we have to do now is see if you can see inside so if you can just see we have a little lever which i've just broke completely <laughs> yeah right so if you can just see inside here we have a little lever you are probably actually best seen it from this side let me just show you so if you can see it here with which we release and then that all forward and brings this down But we're not finished there. So what we've also got, and then underneath we have another lever here, which then brings the bed forward. So it marries up then with the front seat. And then we can then put one cushion down. And then we do have another cushion above the top, which we slot in. And then what we do then is we do drop the seat down then to level everything up so again there is a good size I'll put my feet on a good size bed and then what we can do we can do exactly the same let's take this out we can do exactly the same again with this one i'll just quickly show you there again works exactly the same way and then the seat does swivel around so again we're getting two good sized beds and they really are good sized beds so all we have to do now make the bed back to how it was so if we lift that up that's that one in lift that one up 
and that's one in and then we're back to sitting area easy peasy lemon squeezy so there we have the Devon camper van um, great little two berth camper van and what really gets me is this area here this this dinette area it's, there's so much room and then we make up the single beds which I showed you which are two good single beds for the size of the van and then we also get in our heating our hot water we've got our three-way fridge our little shower area as well so it's everything you really need for a camper van